So, this is the Belvedere Museum. I talked before about it. Very nice. This is the, we can call it the backyard from the museum. And if you buy your tickets over there in the corner, and then you take here a few pictures, you may walk around the museum to get to the main entrance. So when you walk around here, you see this beautiful architecture baroque building like i mentioned before it used to be a palace from the prince french prince here we have a small chapel you can only see when you walk into the museum and you take a look from inside there's some nice windows on the top and you can take a pic usually they're not open to the public here quite interesting we used to have some cages not really a zoo at the time so we talk about the 18th century so there used to be here cages for animals for birds there used to even be a lion around here on the back I showed a video about this Alpine gardens so there's on the other side a beautiful garden you can walk from the main entrance to the side and walk around here quite nice you see people that have their kids it's a nice way to walk around here it's free of charge you pay only to get into the museum but the way that i always recommend the idea to walk behind this nice beautiful building is that later on you can have a beautiful view of vienna the one we call it really the wow view so autumn night now the colors are beautiful and look at that view here folks that's the one i show to my clients when you come to vienna you're gonna have that same view i hope of course it's not raining but here at your feet you see vienna you see also the st stephen's cathedral it's right there in the middle of the town of course, the prince didn't have that view with all these nice new buildings in front of us. On the back at the mountains, we call it District 19. On the top, we have those wine yards, also quite nice. And there are two museums here. We have here the main Belvedere. That's the art museum for Austrian painters. Gustav Klimt, famous kiss is here. And then we have over there, the second Belvedere Museum of Baroque, also quite beautiful. There are always separate tickets for this two museum. Quite nice, beautiful Baroque gardens. It's still the original plane. Not so many small trees, but colorful sandstone. That's quite interesting. During the summertime, quite busy here. People like to sit down read the books here's the belvedere if you have kind of comments please write down your comment i try to answer as soon as possible or get in contact with me if you come to vienna i will show you this beautiful place called belvedere